What is up everybody, Elijah here from Hoosier Pools. Thank you so much for joining me. If you're new, I'd like to welcome you. I am super excited because I finally found some 2024 Topps Chrome blaster boxes so we are going to review these today and i wouldn't be able to without the support of all of my viewers and subscribers and channel members so thank you guys so much if you want to know how to become a member then click the link in the description of this video i truly appreciate it so let's get into it all right everybody before we get into this video i have some mail from my good friend and channel member houdini sports so Thanks always, my friend. I am super excited whenever he sends me mail because it's usually always something insane. So let's see what our first card is. It is a Optic Patrick Wisdom rated rookie black out of 50. This is sick. If you guys are new to the channel, I'm a Patrick Wisdom super collector. I'm a huge Cubs fan, and Patrick Wisdom is one of my favorite players. So this card is a really, really welcome addition to my Patrick Wisdom PC. That is sweet. The old, older style uh, optic baseball, um, like the older designs from like 2017, 2018 are pretty solid. I'm not a huge fan of unlicensed product uh, like now, but some of the older optic stuff looks really, really good. All right, let's see what we got here. I have no clue what this is. They packaged it super, super well. So props to the seller. Oh my goodness. Look at this. This has got to be like one of the coolest relics Christopher Morell out of 25. This is absolutely sick. Two color patch out of 25. It's a super thick card. And also I'm a big uh, mem collector as well. I know a lot of people don't like them, but I love Jersey cards, especially when they're game worn. So that is sweet. Now last, now last but not least, it looks like we have a t-shirt i'm guessing it's gonna be cubs related perhaps okay <laughs> this is sick so this is the uh the iconic reggie miller choke pose and it says what up spike so we're gonna go ahead and put this on for the rest of the video all right, there we go. We got the, the Reggie Miller shirt on. We were actually just talking about that. I, I told him that um, I wish there was like a Reggie Miller uh, like short print image variation of him doing the, uh, the choke to Spike Lee. Um, and he went ahead and got me this shirt. So that is super cool. This is probably one of my favorite shirts now. So getting into 2024 Topps Chrome Baseball, I never thought in a million years uh, of collecting that a blaster box would be $40 plus. So these were $45 at my local card store. We have four cards per pack, seven packs per box. So we have 28 total cards. Find two sepia and two pink refractor parallels inside. Look for highly limited insert sets such as Topps Chrome Expose, Fanatical, and Let's Go. So... Without further ado, this is for science. This is for you guys. I want you to guys to, you know, I'm sure there's, it's, this product's already been out for around a week. So I'm sure you guys have already seen quite a bit um, of review videos. It took me a little while to find this, believe it or not. We got a Henry Davis rookie, Tristan Casas, and we have a Cal Raleigh Green Ray Wave out of 99 so that's not too bad that is that is definitely not too bad i mean cal raleigh big dumper we'll go ahead and put him on the stand but uh for 40 40 dollars per box it's just it's insane it is just insane i can't believe it and then we have our first pink which is abner uribe let me know if you guys have picked this up what you've pulled from it i mean i just I'm, you know, I'm opening this as a review, but personally, I don't think, 
I'm going to get any more. We have a rookie refractor, Steven Cruz, just because of the price. It's just insane. I think singles are definitely the way to go. And I love Chrome. It's fantastic. It looks fantastic this year. Austin Riley, Zach Wheeler. Also, we're looking out for the possible 2024 uh, MVP candidates, Judge and Otani. We got an all edge, Dansby Swanson. That's sweet for my Cubbies PC. But I mean, retail, retail is supposed to be, you know, somewhat affordable. You know, it's, it's supposed to provide you a solid value for, we got Jung Hoo Lee. That's pretty solid. Suppo supposed to provide you a, a solid value for a more affordable price than Hobby. And we have a Prism, Marcus Simeon, and a Mike Trout, Sepia. That's pretty cool. But at $40 a blaster box, I don't know, man. That is that is steep. All right, so we got Andre Lapicius, Josh Hader, Nolan Arenado, Curtis Mead, rocking the shaved head, and, okay, Rafaela Pink. That's not too bad. He's definitely shown that he's got some pop in his bat. Um, I mean, he could he could be really, really solid. So we'll go ahead and take down Patrick Wisdom. So really nice pink, Rafaela. We got two packs left. I mean, I'm having a blast. I'm opening baseball cards. Like what, it is, it's so much fun, you know? I mean, I, I know, here's Jack Leiter, Brandon Lau, Willier Abreu, Rookie Refractor. I mean, I know the price sucks, but I'm just, I mean, I'm just happy to be opening this. Here's Jordan Wicks, one of my PC cubbies. Ian Happ, Max Scherzer. We have Juan Soto in the Strokes and Cattell Marte in the Sepia. So out of our first blaster box, we got a green Ray Wave and a pink Rafaela. But um, that's that's not gonna make up for the forty dollar price, like whatsoever. And I know, always expect to lose money when you're opening sealed retail product. It's you know, you're very very rarely ever gonna make your money back. But I mean, the Cal Raleigh is probably a five dollar card, maybe Rafaela probably another five dollar card. So. I'm, I'm going to say it's probably safe to say we lost like a good $30 on that, that last box. All right, here we go. We got Lawrence Butler starting off with some A's rookies. Zach Geloff, not too bad. Spencer Torkelson, hopefully he figures it out. He got sent down to, oh, that is sweet. That is super sweet. Nolan Jones, a, a Ray Wave, Jackson Holiday. Wow, so these are not numbered but they are very, very difficult to pull. And I'm not sold on Jackson Holiday personally at all. Um, I know he's still super young. Um, you know, he's got a lot of time to figure it out. And then we have a pink Nolan Jones. But I mean, I don't know. I, it was, I mean, it was also a small sample size, you know, watching him bat, I think, you know, going for like one for 37. Trey Turner, Verdugo. We got Zach Remillard uh, in a rookie refractor. But uh, I don't know. I'm just, I'm not sold. I'm not sold at all. I would, I would much rather, you know, keep collecting like Bobby Witt Jr. and Adley. Freddie Freeman, Starling Marte. Future Stars, Michael Harris. Future Stars is probably my least favorite insert set. It looks pretty cool. I kind of like the the throwback design, but it just doesn't just doesn't do it for me. Let me know what your favorite insert set is. I really do like the uh, the all etch. We have Canario, which he's not even. I'm pretty sure he got like DFA'd. He's not even on the roster. We got Yuri Perez, Lamont Wade Jr. in the Prism, Alex Bregman Sepia. So still haven't seen any of the MVP candidates, but. I mean, for what we've gotten, I think we've done pretty decent. We got Noel V. Marte, Trevor Story, Corbin Burns. We got Yuki Matsui and Jack Flaherty, which he's uh, he's actually 
kind of turned out to be a stud this year. So I've been watching a lot of baseball this year. Been playing fantasy. We got Drew Milas, Michael Harris the second, O'Neill Cruz, and David Hamilton, rookie refractor for the Red Sox. So last pack for our second blaster box. Thanks so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this, please give this video a like and subscribe if you haven't already. I'd truly appreciate it. Eduardo Rodriguez, Bo Bichette. Hopefully he can bounce back. We got a nice little Bryce Harper. Uh, I think this is the 88 and Zach Greinke. So 89. So 89 Bryce Harper. That's a really cool card. And then a sepia Zach Greinke. So let's recap really quick. All right, so here we go. We got uh, roughly like 10 base rookies, um, maybe a little bit more from between uh, each of the boxes. We did land two prisms. Uh, we got our four sepias, nothing crazy. I mean, the trout is is nice if you're a trout collector. We got our four pinks. Um, Raffaello was definitely our best one. And then one, two, three, four, five uh, rookie refractors. And we got one numbered card, which was this Cal Raleigh out of 99, this green Ray Wave, which is pretty cool. And then uh, definitely the best hit out of both boxes was this Jackson Holiday uh, Ray Wave Parallel. I'm going to throw up the comps on screen to see, you know, uh, what it's valued at. But overall, I think this was a super fun rip. But maybe if it was like $29.99 a box and not $40 a box, uh, let me know what you guys think. I hope you guys um, get a lot out of this video. You know, hopefully you're able to make a better decision before you go and spend your hard-earned money on this product. So as always, thank you so much for watching. We're going to keep growing, keep making videos. And until next time, we'll see you later.